Hey everyone, Sarnasper here again. I'm also known as Captain Lowell's from Clan Butter Sauce. Um, today I'm going to talk about double twist. If you follow or subscribe to my videos, last time I talked about Boxy and why you should be using that over Windows Media Center uh, and double twist. Today, especially, um, it's important to watch if you have an Android device because double twist makes it easier to sync your music videos, what have you, to your Android device. Personally, I have a Nexus One and Double Twist has made it so much easier. It organizes it on the SD card and all that fun stuff. So to start things off, to get Double Twist you want to go to www.doubletwist.com and then you get this nice pretty page. Uh, you can learn more about it with the about page. It is free. It is a public beta, however, meaning there are bugs and there's missing features. Uh, but like this review says, it is iTunes for Android, and it's very nice for Android users or even PSP. It syncs with a lot of devices, Blackberries, um, any Android device really. Uh, it also, you can search for podcasts, it scans your computer for music, and even it actually scans uh, iTunes and Windows Media Player for playlists and adds those playlists to its own library and it plays video. Uh, so it is a free download like I said. Uh, so with that said, let's get started uh, looking at the application itself. So this is Double Twist. Uh, right away you probably notice that it does look a lot like iTunes the layout is very similar, so it is really easy to get into. Uh, you do have your podcast search here. Search your podcast for whatever podcast you want, whatever your topic you're into. Um, your music store works almost exactly like uh, the iTunes store. You got top albums, top songs. Uh, you can search for your artists, and the only real difference is that it is Amazon MP3, so you have to use your Amazon account, and that's nothing bad. In fact, if you look closely here, uh, iTunes or Amazon MP3 is sometimes cheaper, actually a lot of the time cheaper than iTunes. Uh, you got your profile page there. I don't need to show you that. Uh, pictures. I uh, got a lot of album artwork. Uh, look at this one. You see, you can go to actual size, fit, and then you close it. It's very neat. It's all right in the screen, so you don't need to close anything. You don't need to look for anything. Uh, and then you have videos. Uh, I'll show you a quick clip here. It'll load it up and you have your interface here, your volume here. I'll turn that off. You can browse through. Um, I don't recommend the video player from Double Twist. Uh, it's kind of weird quality and it just uh, it just doesn't work too well right now. Um, but moving on, we have our music. I do like to use Double Twist for music. It's a lot more lightweight. Um, I'll do that when I go through the playlist a little bit. Uh, and then here you have your subscriptions. And subscriptions are just the podcasts you subscribe to. If I go into one of these, you can actually set it to only save the past three, or the latest three. Uh, you can set it to allow automatic delete. Um, play buttons over here or you can just double click. Uh, if the description goes too far you can just mouse over and you have the whole description pointed out or you hit this arrow and then it just wraps the text onto multiple lines. So that's real nice. Um, and then if we move on to playlist you have your purchases playlist and like I said this will actually come uh, most of these playlists, actually I think all of my playlists are from iTunes, you even have the iTunes DJ. Uh, I can probably delete that one. 
and it's real easy. You just right click, delete, ask, are you sure? And you just say yes, and there it goes. So most of these are just albums I have, albums I've bought. Um, and to play, it'll actually, the one thing I do miss is that Double Twist doesn't have random functionality yet. I mean, you can set this to go any way you want, but I do miss random. And it's real easy. It actually opens up a separate uh, window, so you can actually minimize the main window, and you can make this as small as you want, or as big as you want. It's very easy. You can skip to whatever song. It highlights whichever song you're playing, and it's real easy to seek, just like any media player. So that's playlists and music. Uh, but the main thing about Double Twist is the device functionality. Uh, it does have a getting started guide, and it gives you a quick little video library of t the types of devices it can uh, sync to, and even just these 10, ten images, and you, it's almost every device you can think of. So I do have my Nexus One plugged in. I'll show you how this works real quick. Um, so I've now mounted my SD card with my Nexus One plugged in. Uh, so it should pop up pretty soon. There it is. Uh, you have your, if you look down here, you have your device interface, Google Nexus One, uh, pictures, videos, and movie, uh, pictures, videos, and music. Excuse me. Um, and if you look closely here, if you go to just the general screen, it is syncing. I'm going to stop that because it will get in the way of this screencast. So anyway, you can select the media you want. This is very, very, very similar to iTunes. It's very easy to use. Show you your memory capacity. Go to pictures. Uh, I don't sync pictures. I sync my music. You can pick which playlist to sync. Uh, videos. I don't sync any videos. And your subscriptions. You can sync your subscriptions too. So every time you plug in, if there's a new podcast out, it'll upload the new one and delete the last one because remember, uh, it'll delete. Um, it'll only save the latest three episodes. If you set it to that, you can set it to five or even save them all. Uh, so every time you plug it in, it'll sync just like iTunes. Um, that is it for Double Twist. So thanks for watching. Hey everyone, uh, one more thing about Double Twist and its device uh, functionality. Um, if you do sync videos and movies uh, it's very easy all you have to do is go into your videos uh, pick whatever video you want scroll down to your device of choice and just drag that video into that device you'll see the plus one that means it's it knows what to do um, uh, double twist will automatically convert it to the proper format proper size um, and it'll start syncing right away so uh, if you have any comments, questions, uh, feel free to leave them in the comment section. Uh, if you have any suggestions or if you want to see certain programs, uh, feel free to send me a message or leave them in the comments too. I'll try to keep up with the comments. Um, but thanks again, and we'll see you next time.